you know, another aspect of obviously being in Europe for me and kind of adding on to what I talked about earlier, when we do, we go out and do stuff as a team. We go, we travel cool places and there'll be nights where it's like late at night and I'm just walking through like, I see like Munich or, you know, you're in Berlin or wherever you are. Like we were in Barcelona a couple of years ago with some friends. Like you're just walking through these crazy cool cities at night with like some of your best friends and you're like, what the heck am I doing right now? That, that to <laughs> me is always the craziest thing. Like, what am I doing right now? Just walking like, like these places you see on TV and in movies and stuff and you're walking there. Just That to me is always the craziest thing. Yeah. Uh, and it's always like when it's night, when it's later on, you're just kind of strolling and you're like, where the heck, what the heck am I doing right now? It's crazy like because like, you think of it like you're getting paid for this and other people, yeah. like, well, like when they're on vacation, they're like, oh my God, I want to go back. For us, it's just like a you're normal day. Yeah. <laughs> you travel, stay in these super nice hotels here in like Trento, Trentino, Italy, like in this beautiful, in the mountains in Italy, in this dope hotel, and I literally walk out, and I'm like, I have a patio there, and I'm overlooking the mountains on a river there, and we're there to play a match. Like, people travel here, like, they save up their entire life to go on trips here, and I'm so just like, on. there for two nights, stay, eat dank Italian food. We had, in Italy, Modena, they, uh, they treated us, uh, after we... Uh, had an exhibition match with them. They treated us to, uh, I think it was Modena. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong about that. Um, we played Modena. I don't know if it was that night. I'm pretty sure. But we, uh, it was basically the Brazilian steakhouse version of pizza. Any oh possible pizza God. you can imagine, they're just coming out on trays and they just walk around. You have a, you have a um, card, green, red card. So it was green light all night and you're just trying the best pizza. It was, phew. so that's what I'm talking about. You just go to these places and have this amazing, we were in, Belgium. We, had, we literally had a hotel for Champions League. It was like they had this person downstairs, like a chef, just making Belgian waffles, fresh Belgian waffles. We'd walk down. What's the difference between like a Belgian waffle and a know. waffle? Can you the t- name. T- taste the difference? Uh, like so if you give egg a waffle versus different. a Belgian waffle? Hey, obviously, it's way better. I don't know what the difference is, though. But No, no, but I'm saying can you taste the difference? Yeah, an okay. egg a waffle. All right, but like, uh, all right, nicer than that one. But like a nice waffle versus like a Belgian waffle. Yeah, you okay. definitely can taste it. Crunchier, things. softer inside. I I don't even fully remember, but they were unbelievable. I will say that. You can you can handle the heat. Yeah. You can and you can handle the heat.